What you are now watching is the movie Alice in Wonderland. This is, came out of a 1995 VHS, I mean the 1994 VHS of Alice in Wonderland, which I'm watching it right now. And as you see here, I'm going to present to you a 2011 LG 26 inch LED TV. Yesterday, I picked it up at Best Buy for about $449.99. It's brand new. I, well, as you've seen in my unboxing video on my Home of the Good Guys channel, I had a great time to have an unboxing video. It's great to have. It's brand new, high definition, indeed. I'm just giving a little bit of a demonstration while you're up before we do... Before we go any further than this, I have actually got this television. I cut the right size. I hooked it up. I set it up, and it's excellent, excellent picture quality. Very, very good. And this is very interesting to wa to watch. And this is what you're about to see right now. It's a a new television. And it's brand new for 2011. I, I picked it up um, yesterday. I hooked it up, I set the channels up, and it's pretty good. But now I'm, I'm just going to give a little demonstration for you. This is, it has an LG logo. And here's your setup, has the channel button functions. There was no buttons at that point. There's your volume. There's your enter button button, there's a home and input, and there's the power. There is no buttons. Yeah, there used to be buttons on there, but now it's got a touch thing on there. Yeah, it's kind of a new thing because TV is the new thing of the future, but you can see the back of the panel. The back panel has, the back has the LG logo. Yeah, you can't see that, but it has a, uh, but as you see here, the back panel shows the LG logo, and here's your um, here's the digital optional uh, audio out put. There's the uh, what is this? What is this? I have I, I can't see that. I know you can't see. But think about it. Oh yeah. I can't see my reflection here. Has the uh, HDMI audio? There was this. Has the DVI audio in? Put the HDMI jack. There's the computer plugs. It yeah, has the RGB to PC. Has the stuff for the PC when you go on a computer. There's your audio or video input. There's the the streaming jack RCA plugs. These are the old RCA jack, RCA plugs to it. But this is a very very good indeed and uh, and here's your antenna and of course it's got the UL listed on there and uh, of course it says energy verified and the date I think it, it's manufactured May 2011 as you see May 2011 that was like the month when Harold Camping was predicted to, that the, the end of the world was coming was supposed to come on this on the month about a month ago. This was manufactured a month ago. It was the same month when Harold Camping was predicted the end of the war was was supposed to come. It never happened. Nothing is written in the Bible, but nothing happens in the Bible. But according to the Bible, I know it's not like it's the day of Doomsday. The Judgment Day was actually was affected by the Doomsday thing and all that kind of stuff. Are just totally bogus. I'm not going to any do any detail about Harold Camping or whatever it is. So. It's probably the most, yeah, it was one of the most uh, 
intelligent people who was also the founder and president of Family Radio was uh, we was apologizing for why the the end it was like Jesus Christ is coming back or whatever it is he's going to be destroy the world for the next five months it'll be destroy the, our planet well that never happened not in 2012 if you know the movie it, not it, not 2012 nothing happens well I'm not going to go into detail right now okay enough already let's get to the the actual features of this it also has a remote control and of course it's got the input button, AV mode, energy, it's like energy saving, the power button, there's your your keypads, your channel and volume, fave, ratio, mute. These are all color coded buttons. Oh, back. Uh, sim, punk, exit, enter, quick menu, home, uh, info, and of course these buttons are playback, pause, fast forward, rewind, and uh, play. And also has, a, has the uh, LG logo. Two C batteries that had came with this one. And here's your here's your volume control. It has a nice cool feature of this. Yeah, it goes up to 100. Yeah, it goes up to a hundred. There's your volume. There's your there's your buttons. And here's the um, the actual button you can see: aspect ratio, picture mode, sound mode, sleepy timer, caption, aspect ratio. Yeah, you, you can see how. Here's has standard. You should pick a size of the picture. Here's vivid. There's Intelligent Sensor, Standard, Cinema, Sport, Game, Expert 1 and Expert 2. And of course you go back to the main menu. And here's your sound mode. Pick which sound, whatever you desire. And here's your sleep timer. You had to pick which, how many minutes, or how many minutes you have for two hours and stuff like that. Here's your caption, and of course you can turn on your caption and see what it is. Yes, it's got the closed caption screen. For those of you who have never seen, it's not like subtitles. Yes, it, all Disney VHS tapes this can, is, does, did contain a closed caption. Yeah, have you seen the closed caption logo on there? Yeah, closed caption can be found on all Disney VHS tapes. And if you look at that, it has... That's, uh, you can't, like, the language you can't speak or anything like this. It's like subtitles or dubbed versions or something like that. Here's your... Here's the aspect ratio. You can set by program. You can set it in full screen form. Here's the full screen of it, and you can see black bars side by side. But if, for those of you who own the, the, the Blu-ray release of Alice in Wonderland, uh, the animated version, this past February, back last winter when it was recently came out, if you popped in the Blu-ray, I don't know why, it, it was going side by side. It was like, if you've seen, it's on a, it's on a standard size. I don't know. If they, this is like a go... It has black bars on them, but it's going side by side. Here's 16 by 9. It's pretty wide. It's 4 by, 4 by 3, and there's the zoom feature. Yeah, you can see it's. You could zoom it all the way through. I don't know. There's the cinema zoom. Wow, I cannot believe that. It's um, it's a matter of trust. There's your television. Now let's get back to the 16 by 9. And there you go. There's your info. Oh, there's the uh, info on there. It's no program information because I'm watching a, a movie on the DVD on a VHS tape. Here's your channel. Function is not available now. 
I have to set this on. Uh, yeah, here's the, it gives you the input list. There's your channels. There's cable. Here's your 33. There's your channels on there. And now we're going back to the back to the input displays. And of course, here's your here's the home screen. Here's your channel feature. You can use auto tuning or manual tuning or channel edit. But you had to do start or close. You had to close. You have to pick which channel you want. Here's the picture wizard. Yeah, the picture wizard has another feature that came with it. You can see the picture with the little thing on there. Here's your standard screen or preferred. Preferred. There's your brightness, which is the black level. I think it's black. There's the white level. There's the tint. There's the color, which is color sets in medium, original, high, medium, original, high. Yeah, it must be the original. And there's uh, the sharpness picture. And there's the dynamic contrast. And you can set the temperature, like the warm, backlight. There's your uh, AV. And then, yeah, these are all the televisions on there. As you can close. And there's your... Um, Here's an interesting feature, SimLink. You can watch TV, disc, VCR, HDD recorder, and speaker. I don't know if you've never heard of the SimLink before. And, um, and here's the flashback button. And you have no flashback at this time. Here's the ratio. Yeah, it has a ratio, but... Yep, it has, and there's your, uh, here's your mute, the mute button. There you go. There you go. And plus, it's got an interesting feature, the AV mode. Cinema, sport, game, off. And here's your energy, here's an interesting cool feature, energy savings. Medium, maximum, displays will be turned off. And the display is on. And there you go. That was my uh, demonstration of the LG 26 inch LED HD TV. Got it today at, uh, I got this yesterday at Best Buy. Very, very good. I'm glad I enjoyed this very much. I'm so happy when I got this television, and it's a very, a very, very good. And that's all you got. That's all I got to say about it. And that's all for my demonstration. I'll see you again soon. Probably see you later in my next video. Thanks for watching. And now I'm gonna watch Alice in Wonderland. I'm gonna continue while I'm in this video right now. So um, there you go. That's all I can say for now. I'll go back and watch Alice in Wonderland while I'm enjoying watching my LG TV. See you later.